Um, this is a brief overview of um, taking an animated character out of an application like Maya and into a gaming engine like uh, Unity and then applying some, um, some keys to actually on the keyboard to make him do some moves. Okay, so let's just have a look what we've got set up here. Uh, right now I'm actually inside Unity. Um, we'll be moving over to um, Maya just to show you the actual walkthrough. Okay, so if I push play, let's see, see what we get here. So a very simple scene, and it says hit D key. So if I hit D on the keyboard, and this guy will do a little dance. Okay, fairly simple. Each time I hit D, it will trigger the event or the key. Okay, so I'll just stop that. All right, so basically I've created this character and um, the character is rigged. I have a whole bunch of controls for the mouth, etc. In here. Okay. And I've also got a blink control. Okay. So you can see that. And eye controls here, so the eyes are looking around. Okay. And I have a animation on this character. Let's see what that's like. And I will add my character and we'll see what we get here okay so my character is set up uh, with the motion capture file um, just hide that so as you can see them a bit easier okay so one to one and you'll notice that his controls are still working he can still blink okay so he's ready to go so how did I well there's that move so it's about exporting that move out isn't it so how did I do that well basically this one goes over looks like 40 frames fairly short one this is what I need to do one I need to select the geometry, okay, and then two, I need to select the hips. Actually, I select the hips first, then I go up and I select the geometry, like that. And then I go File, Game Exporter, and in here, I make sure that Model is selected, and I'll select, not Export All, but Export Selection. And skinning is on smoothing groups just like this okay settings animation needs to be turned on and embedded media okay and then Y and I'll change that to ASCII because mine's an ASCII file and then I have to tell it where I'll export it to etc okay um, this one I think I exported out onto my desktop game test yeah, I'll call this Alien Dance 2. Okay. Actually, for a start, this is the folder. I'll tell it just the folder. And now I can write the name of the file Dance 2. Then hit export. Maya will do some calculations. Um, should be successful. Close that. I can now minimize Maya, bring up my software package, and this is where you needed to bring in the actual uh, the dance. Okay, and I will go assets, import new asset, and you need to search for your area. So mine was called dance two. Import that. And you'll know if it's actually worked or not by immediately coming down to the bottom right over here where it says take 001. And if you can push play, and if you actually see the animation here, then you know it's working. There we go. So that's actually worked. Fantastic. 
Okay, so you know it's actually pulled the animation in and it's working. Okay, okay, in the next session, I'll go over how to apply that animation to our character inside the scene within Unity. Okay, thanks for watching.